everyone. My name is Laquita Burnett, also known as Freedom Curls. And today we are doing an Olaplex treatment, but not just your regular Olaplex treatment. We are doing the new 4-in-1 Moisture Mask. So, so far we've done a all over highlight and low light, as you can see here. And we use our set one Olaplex in the color. We also use it in our toner. And right now, she's currently sitting with the Olaplex number two. So she's already been sitting for about 15 minutes. So now we're gonna get ready to rinse and follow with the shampoo and the four in one treatment. So Rhea, go ahead and put your head back. This is my beautiful client, Rhea. <laughs> she's got beautiful curls. So what I like to do when I do our treatment, we always kind of twist the hair and that kind of keeps the curl intact. It kind of trains the curl. I hope you guys can hear me. So we're just rinsing number two before we get ready to shampoo. I love number two, especially post color service because her hair, it basically feels like butter. It feels like nothing happened to it, chemical wise. The Olaplex treatment is great for strengthening the hair and rebuilding the bonds after a chemical service. You can also use it on your curly clients or wavy or straight clients with or without being chemically treated. Someone's asking, how big of a section do you do for the twist? When you it twist doesn't the really matter. Once we're just putting in the treatment, it really doesn't matter. As long as I can get a really nice spiral. So I would say about a square. Like four across, four in the back, two at the bottom. is my typical sectioning. But it doesn't have to be perfect. So now we are using our Olaplex number four, and you can also use the new 4P for your blondes. Um, I don't want to tone her with the shampoo, the 4P shampoo. She'll do that at home. So we're just going to use the regular number four because she just got a toner. Rhea, do you use the number 4P at home? I do. Do you like it? I love it. Yes. <laughs> So a big thing I teach my clients about Olaplex, the product is very concentrated. So before we put it on a hair, we always emulsify it like lotion, just rub, rub, rub until it's nice and spread. That way you don't overuse the product because it's concentrated. It's going to spread. It's going to really get through the hair and do what it does. So see how much lather it already did. And I just did like a drop of the number four. With curly hair, I try not to disturb the curl too much when I shampoo. So I'll rub it downward to keep that cuticle flat. And then I'll just scrub the roots. So normally with the number two treatment, we would follow with the number four to rinse out. And then the number five, regular conditioner. But now we have the four in one, which is a deeper moisturizing mask that is actually pretty cool because you can let it sit for 10 minutes and it does the work. Like regular moisture wrap masks that I've used before, you have to let it sit for a long time. What I like about the new four in one, you don't have to let it sit too long. So that makes her color service a lot faster and she gets a lot more moisture. So make sure to make it sit that 10 minutes to get the full benefits. And when I put it on, I will twist it into her hair. They're asking, uh, would you do the mask under the dryer, under a dryer? You can, 
But since she just got a treatment, a color treatment, I wouldn't because her cuticle is already pretty open. You can, but you don't have to. I believe it's still going to do the same thing. But for somebody who has like virgin hair or a more flat cuticle and you want to raise that cuticle a bit with heat, go for it. Yeah, she's got a good shampoo. Look at all that sud. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna win. I hope you guys are having a great Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. <laughs> we're making tacos today. <laughs> Black bean tacos. <laughs> With cilantro. And yeah, for those that are checking in, we are about to do the four-in-one Olaplex moisture treatments. The new four-in-one moisture treatment has great benefits for all your hair types, color treated, non-color treated. It delivers lots of moisture in 10 minutes. It's not your regular conditioner. It is a deep penetrating mask. So she's fully red. So now we're going to go in with about three or four pumps of this guy. So again, make sure you emulsify because this stuff will spread. If you don't see it on the hair, that's okay. It's going in there. It's absorbing. Someone asked, how often would you offer this service? I would do it every color service. And then I would also do it as a standalone service. So right now my um, regular Olaplex standalone treatment would involve the number one, the number two, the number five, and the number four. Uh, and I said that in the wrong order, but you know what I mean. So one, two, and then four, five. Now with a slight pr price increase, I'm offering the number one, the number two, four, and then four and one. You have the option to make it whatever you want it to be. I don't believe you can do too much Olaplex. So every time your client comes, you can do that treatment. Someone's asking, is this treatment more geared towards thicker hair or uh, will it be too much towards a finer curl? Do you think it'll be good? So it's for all textures. So um, just like the bottle says, it adds body. So that means this treatment, it's not gonna weigh your hair down. So for thicker hair, like Reyes, I might even add a little bit more, but if you're concerned about it being weighed down on the hair, just maybe start with two pumps and then add to it. I started with three pumps and I feel like she could use a little bit more. Her hair's really thirsty. And her hair is really thick, so instead of three, I'm going to use about five. And I'm going in with two more pumps. But you be the judge. I do the same thing with my styling product with the number six. If it's not enough, I just add to it. For finer hair, start small and just add to it. And you could use your tangle teaser, a comb, or a wet brush. I have my little brush here. And so, again, I'm just going to go in those sections. They're not going to be perfect. And always with curly hair, I start from the ends. So, if you turn around this way, please. I don't like that background. Thank you. Oh, my gosh, y'all. It comes through. Brush it through so good. You guys are going to love it. I'm so funny. <laughs> but I'm so serious. So yeah, you can see if you zoom in, even though it disappeared in the hair, when you start to brush it, look how much you can see on the hair. Like it is on there. See that? So don't someone, be afraid to use a little bit. Someone asked, do you charge extra for the Olaplex service? I do. But that's up to you at your salon. 
you be the judge. You know, you pay for product. It's extra time. So depending on how you price yourself, keep that in mind. So you have a curly hair, especially after color, it gets tangled. So don't rush. Sometimes what I like to do too, if her hair gets a little caught and I can't brush through, I'll just add a little bit of water to it because it's drying and you don't want to brush it too much when it's drying. Someone's asking where you got that brush from. Oh, I sell these. <laughs> but I'm sure Amazon has something similar. Just look up shampoo brush. It's sort of kind of like a, a tangle teaser, but not really. So yeah, you see, I'm just gently, gently brushing through. And this is still the number four in one deep conditioning mask. Still working with that right now. You do not have to shampoo this one out. You can just rinse it. And that's because it delivers moisture, just like your regular number five conditioner, only deeper. Like the number two, you have to shampoo that out because it's just strengthening, it's not moisturizing. So this is a treatment that is actually moisturizing. And then if Rhea wants to continue this form one at home, we'll recommend her to take home the number eight, which is similar post salon visit at home treatment that she can do at home herself to continue to get the same moisture results from the Olaplex line. How do you guys like her color? I also like doing the twist because it keeps me neat when I'm detangling her hair instead of doing it all together. And again, it also curl trains the hair. Because when you highlight hair, especially curly hair, you could lose the curl pattern. So sometimes you have to re regenerate that curl, almost like train it back to where it needs to be. Yeah, I didn't set a timer, so I'm just guessing by song. <laughs> I feel like we're on like two. We're on the second song, so when this song goes off, we'll rinse. So someone said they missed the beginning, so what product are you using right now? So right now we're on four and one, which is what the whole live is about. But we started with Olaplex number one. We did that in her color. After a color process, we rinsed. We also did it in her toner. And then after that was rinsed and shampooed out, we did Olaplex number two. And we let that sit for about 15 minutes. And then we shampooed that out with number four. <laughs> after that was shampooed out, we used the Irvine <laughs> number four and one. And this is the big one that we're talking about today. This is the new guy that we are in love with. And it's great. We just, we never had a conditioning mask from Olaplex. We just had the regular conditioner. So this is a game changer for her. Her hair definitely feels like butter. And that's what we want. We don't want the hair to feel like cardboard. We want it to feel like butter. <laughs> <laughs> and after that sits, we don't really need to use the number five because she's already got a really good moisturizing mask. And this is just a regular conditioner. Um, so this would have normally been used after the number four. So instead, we're using the four and one for a lot more moisture delivery. You could use this on your straight clients. You could use this on your curly clients. You could use this on your color treated clients, your non-color treated cl clients. Um, yeah. So my kids use it on their Barbies. No. <laughs> so then after this is set, I think the song went off. So we'll go ahead and bring so after that is rinse, we're going to style with the number six. And she loves this oil. So, of course, I'm going to use the Olaplex number seven. And then we're going to send her home with Olaplex number eight because she's an Olaplex junkie. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and she loves me and trusts everything I say. Pretty much. <laughs> you need this. 
Okay. <laughs> so yeah, no need to shampoo it out. We're just gonna rinse it out. I feel like there's no more hot water or something, so I'm sorry. It's a little cold. <laughs> So yeah, do you guys have any other questions before I style? We're just going to style and dry her after this. And I will post um, the afters on my Instagram story so you guys can see the finished result. I don't think we have enough time to catch the whole drying and fluffing and cutting process. How, many, how, many, how long did we go? Oh, okay. Not that long. I'm pretty fast with styling, so... The drying part might get a little loud, though, when we start drying her hair. Okay, we're going with this guy and this guy. Any questions, guys? Can we use the brush for detangling balayage, someone asks. Of course, yeah. How do you normally detangle a balayage? I use my shampoo brush, but I also sometimes use a paddle brush. It just depends on whatever brush is nearby for me. But yeah, just make sure when you detangle your balayage, you don't detangle it all at the same time. So when I detangle mine, I do it in the sections that they were lightened. Because if I try to brush it all together, it gets crazy. It gets really tangled. You guys are in for a treat, too, because I don't show anybody how I style on my Instagram. Mm -hmm. That's like a secret. So you guys get to see my little secret. Someone asked, so you just put it in right at the bowl? Oh, yeah. Because curly hair... Like she was getting dry as I was putting the four in one in. So I need water. So I'm going to add water to her products in her hair to keep it wet. So I really can't do that at my chair. So I need a clip. I'll be right back. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and sit up a bit. So I always start in the back. Kind of section it off. And then I'll take my little brush and I just kind of detangle each section and I'll curl it with my hand and my brush. Right? And that's it. That's how I set my curly clients. It really makes a difference that we did this treatment. The way the curls just glide through the brush, her curls would not glide like this if we had not done the Olaplex treatment. So for us in the salon, Olaplex is a must. You absolutely have to get Olaplex when your hair is color treated. Because bleach, I mean, bleach compromises the hair. It turns your hair into, you know, a different pattern, a different texture. It gets rough. So if you're not putting that moisture that protein back into the hair then your hair is going to be damaged the client's hair is going to be damaged so that's what i love about olaplex when i use olaplex the hair feels like brand new all over again Taco Tuesday. <laughs> if you're a hairstylist and you've been working hours on your client, you know how I feel right now. I am hungry. Starving. I'm starving. I'm so happy we're almost done. We're, we're going straight to food after this. Immediately. <laughs> 
<laughs> Look at her curls, guys. Like after two hours of lightening her hair, her curls still look good. She's got that hair that looks like it's not curly when it's wet, and then when it's dry, all the curls come. <laughs> like surprise, I'm curly, not not wavy. <laughs> And sometimes that scares me, honestly, as a stylist, when I see my client's hair, if I've never done their hair before, and I color their hair, and then when it's wet, it's straight. I'm like, oh my gosh, <laughs> the lightener made her hair straight. And then I do an Olaplex treatment. I'm like, oh, okay, okay, false alarm. <laughs> just kidding. Yeah, just kidding. So I don't have that fear of over-processing people's hair when I use an Olaplex treatment. Olaplex is definitely my baby. I need it in every service. Hashtag Olaplex every service. Oh, definitely. So post treatment, before I even start on a color service, I let my client know you're going to have to do this treatment once a week because color is an investment. What do you guys think so far? Raya, how do you like to dry your hair? Um, did you? Yeah. Did you ever get a Dyson? I didn't. Oh, Christmas is coming. It is. I saw one at Best Buy. <laughs> <laughs> and they have, I think they have them on sale. They actually are. At Sephora, yeah. At where? I think I saw Sephora's having a sale, I think. Oh. I'm selling so on sale at Best Buy. Hmm. Any other questions? Right now, we've done the full Olaplex treatment with the 4 in 1. So now we're just styling with number six and number seven, and we're about to get ready to diffuse her. She just got her hair color touch up, and her hair feels amazing because of our Olaplex 4-in-1 treatment doing its thing. Ray, for me, can you look up just a bit? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Who Olaplex asked, asked um, how did your Olaplex journey begin? How did my Olaplex journey begin? Mm -hmm. I believe a client, a client told me. Okay. And I saw it in the beauty supply, but I'm just, I don't like to use new products. <laughs> I'm like old school. Once I find something I like, I keep it. But yeah, it was years ago and I had a client. She came in, her hair felt so soft. I'm like, what do you use? She's like, Olaplex. I'm like, what is that? And she was like, it's this product I get from Sephora and just like a treatment that I do. And I start using it. And I'm like, how was I doing hair color without this product? How? So yeah, that's how. One of my clients, my client put me on. And then yeah, ever since then, I see the results. I love the results. And we tag Olaplex in all of our results. And they love our posts and yeah, we love Olaplex. It's one big happy family now. <laughs> Someone asked, uh, do you let it air dry a little bit before diffusing or do you go straight into diffusing? Straight to diffusing because we love big body bouncy hair. Big hair. So I'm going to sit Raya up because she has bangs and I want her hair to go forward. So I'm going to sit up Raya. You just go throw this way. And then nope. Back there. I don't want this back there. Oh, this stuff. There you go. And then just look down. Perfect. Maybe not so much. <laughs> yeah, for the clients that got the veins, I'm going to bring her hair forward. So I got to smash you in the face. If you look down just a little bit more, it won't hit you in the face too much. <laughs> yeah, she has veins, so we're going to set this going this way. I want her veins to stick up straight in the air. <laughs> And I like to give it a little shake too before I lay it down because that kind of makes the curls get a little clearer too. So I'm 
curl it with my brush and shake and go. I love these educational lives and videos that Olaplex does. I've definitely learned some neat tricks from watching these lives. So thank you guys, all you guys for watching and tuning in today. I hope you guys continue to be supportive and follow. Rhea's got her color done. She's ready for Christmas. <laughs> and New Year's. Yeah. <laughs> Coming to New Year like, yeah. <laughs> okay. So I don't like the scrunch. It makes it frizzy, especially color treated hair. We leave it alone. We go straight to dry. So you guys can follow us. <laughs> Okay, you ready? Yes. So I have my client slide down the chair. Go ahead and slide down, hang off the back. Perfect. And then we just start drawing. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I get facials as well. <laughs> and here's Becky, if you want, I can hold it real quick. So I'm going to hold this camera real quick for Zucky so he can clean the shampoo bowl for us because we do practice sanitation in the salon. So give us just a second. And yeah, when I diffuse, I do not touch. I just cover like so. No touching. Just cover. Zoom in on those curls. Ooh. Looks so good. Look at those ringlets. Oh my gosh. I'm in love with her hair. <laughs> I just need to take it and put it on my head. <laughs> I feel like every curly girl has a story about how they did not like their hair or did not like something about their hair at one point. Okay. Okay, so I'm handing the phone back to the camera, back to Zucky. Zucky, can you hand me the other diffuser? Yes. Uh, someone asked, is there a particular reason why you don't touch the hair when diffusing right now? Because you want to let the product sit into the hair and form a cast around the curl. If you start to touch it, you're going to create frizz prematurely. Okay? So I'll wait until the hair is 70% dry, maybe 80% dry before I start to push it up. Okay? Let me get that other one. Oh, yeah. How do you know when somebody asked a question? Because I was like looking for it. I, I couldn't. Oh, okay. Perfect. So I'll just cover and Zucky will help me answer you guys' questions. Can we do it from this angle over here? Someone asked. 
Um, how long have you been in the business for? Um, I did perfect. Is your neck okay, Brian? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> if you need to adjust, let me know. Okay, so I've been a. It's a long story, guys. Okay, let me start. So, <laughs> I started my passion when I was twelve. I was twelve years old braiding. My cousin taught me how to braid, and it was up from there. So I was the high school braider in the cafeteria at lunchtime, braiding everybody's hair. I'm gonna leave some parts out, but yeah. Fast forward to now, to 2000, 2008. So I became professional in 2009. And then I discovered the curly hair world, curly hair world about 2015. 2015 is when I did my big chop. And I was like, wow, I have really curly hair. So everybody needs to feel like I feel with this big chop and this new discovery of my hair being curly and I never knew it. So that's what kind of got me into the curly game when I did my own big chop. So yeah, doing curly hair since 2015 and hair in general since 2009. Can you reach and turn the light up? Is the light, is there enough light? I just feel like, how's that? It looks really good, actually. It does? Okay. I was seeing a shadow. That's why I went. I think it's just coming down a little bit. So, yeah, guys, I'm just hovering. No touching. If you touch, you're going to get frizz. Your client's going to do their hair in two days. Someone asked, they missed a little bit of the styling. So, you rinsed it and then what? Any other styling products before you dry? Um, Olaplex number six and Olaplex uh, number seven. And then I took my brush and I curled it. And I took it in sections. So I did one section, sorry. One section, one section, one section. Ray has been getting burnt up all day today. All day. <laughs> we clearly cannot multitask. <laughs> She's taking one for the team today. <laughs> we love you. I love you You're going home with number, number eight today. <laughs> Someone asked, can you put them under a dryer or would it, the results not be the same? You can, but she'll be flat. So I'm going to diffuse her the whole way. I'm going to have her sit up and flip her hair. And that's going to create some volume. And then again, when she's 70% dry, I'm going to push it in. If I push it in now, her hair really hasn't set into the product. So she's going to get frizzy. You kind of need the product to sit into the hair before you touch it. I don't know if you guys have ever heard the curly terms, but there's a curly term that we call a cast like a cast of the product. So I want the cast of the product to form before I touch it, because if I touch it too soon, I'm gonna break the cast. Especially with cream, when you style with Olaplex number zero, I'm sorry, Olaplex number six, it has no hold to it. So I don't wanna to touch her hair too much when the product already doesn't have a hold and create frizz. Yeah, now her ends are pretty dry. I think I'm going to go ahead and start lightly, lightly pushing it in. And for everybody who's just now coming in, we did the Olaplex 4-in-1 treatment on my blonde curly client today. She just got color. She just got her blonde touched up. So now we are styling after the treatment has been done. How you feeling? Is it hot or you good? I'm good. Okay. Just scream at me if I burn you. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, if you're like bougie like me, get two dices because your clients will love you. You'll get this in and out in like 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> we got that on camera. We've got that on camera. <laughs> Look at the dice ago. Wow. We heard on camera. <laughs> 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 Zucky, do you mind if I gloves on? Can you reach and fill her in? How do they feel? Are they feel a little dry? So no, they're a little bit wet. Okay. Just a teensy bit. Yep. 
So I'm gonna get those ends all the way dry, and then once they're ends all the way dry, we're we'll gonna sit up and flip. So now that she's mostly dry, you guys see I'm not pushing it all the way in, I'm just kind of bouncing. Bounce, bounce, bounce. The other one, I'm hovering. I hope you guys are enjoying this. Do you guys have any other questions? We're getting pretty close to the end of our live, so ask your questions now because we're about to exit the building and we'll post the afters in my Instagram story. Raya, if you want to, post it up. And then once you're ready, can you flip to the side? <laughs> oh, zoom in on that color. Woo! I hope you guys love the flipping is important so she can have volume. Someone's asking, do you charge for OPEX treatment like you use multiple treatments today, like the two and the four on one, or is it all one price? I charge uh, more for the new four in one treatment, and I charge my regular starting price for the standalone treatment. So, like our regular standalone treatment is the one, two, four, and five. That's in salon. But now, with the four in one, I believe it's a little extra, you know? So I'm doing the number one, I'm letting the number two sit, I'm shampooing number four, and then I let the number four sit, four in one, sit a little bit longer. So since it's sitting a little bit longer, it's just a, sm a slight price increase. But you be the judge, you know? Again, you're the hairstylist, you make what you decide. If you feel like you're doing extra work and you're buying extra product, charge what you're worth. I never tell people my prices or what they should charge or, you know, I just, I'm the judge of what I want to charge. A lot of my clients come in, they don't even know what they're going to pay. I don't even know what they're going to pay until I'm done. They don't, yeah, they love me, but it depends on how much product I use and then how long it takes. That's what I charge by, the hour and the product usage. A lot of my curly clients, they're in the salon about four hours when they get colored. I am thinking about changing up my services a little bit, though, and making Olaplex in every single service. Right now, I do it as an add-on because I do my pricing a la carte. I'm thinking about changing it up for next year and doing bundles. So we'll see. We'll see. But again, that's up to, that's up to me as a stylist. What I feel like I'm worth. Hey, I'm going to flip her to the other side. So let me back up. Yes. Let me flip. And yes, sit. Like, no, no, no. Sit into it. Because you're in the light. You know how you sit there sometimes? Yeah. yeah. How's it look? Uh, fabulous. Look at her curls, guys. Still intact. Thank you, Olaplex 4 and one <laughs> Olaplex 4 and one all day, baby. <laughs> and you guys see her curls? There is no frizz. No frizz. But I'm going to make her frizzy later. Once she's dry, I'm going to fluff it. So you guys will get to see that in my Instagram story. We'll post the after there. Any other questions for me, Beth? Five minutes? Yeah. We'll hang out with you guys
Instagram. It is hair. It should be uh, her username uh, that you see at the bottom left corner. Um, it's also hair by Laquita Burnett. You can also find us by Freedom Curl Friends. Yes. That's our client selfie page. Freedom Curl Friends. And my personal is here by Laquita Burnett. And the one that's filming behind the scenes, and you'll see. The lovely person in the background is hair by Ricky. Yes. Some, uh, someone said beautiful curls. Someone said, how much is the four in one? How much is the four in one? Uh -huh. For the toe price, it should be the same as all the others, which is 14 And then for the other two, it's 15 And then for the other two, it's 15 Hopefully, I'm right. <laughs> but yeah, from what I know, every other product online for the pros, for stylists, are $14 each, unless you get a bigger size. So I'm going to get ready to flip forward. Okay. So there you go. Oh, this is forward. Perfect. And it's come up just a little bit. There you go. It's still feeling kind of like this one. You have a little shaky shake. Shake your hair just a little bit. Yeah, guys, she's mostly done, but not all the way yet. So you're gonna take forever to dry, y'all, but don't, don't half do it. Like, get, get yeah. your quiet dry. They'll be, they'll be frizzy if you don't. <laughs> and I love this color. She's usually mostly blonde, but we added some low light because of the winter time. You don't want your clients to be too bright. But she just lets me do whatever I want. <laughs> Look at those curls still intact. Like four in yeah. one come through. Yeah. Four in one treatment come through. One last question, Lupita. Someone asked, uh, someone said she is late on here, but is the hormone product you apply and rinse out or is it a wearable treatment? Oh, I would rinse it out. Mm -hmm. Rinse yeah, it out. I would follow the instructions. Um, I never leave in conditioner unless it's an actual leave-in. Um, but it might weigh you down. I don't think it would hurt, but I would not want my hair to be weighed down. I have styling products for that. So yeah, I would go ahead and rinse it out. I'm going to set Rhea under the dryer for her roots. I'm going to look up just a bit. Okay. So yeah, while she's under the dryer, we'll answer any other questions before we head out. Mm -hmm. Let's rotate back over to the products. Ready. Into the forward one. Thank you, girl. Thank you. So sweet. So just keep your head up for me. So, yeah. Any questions? We're almost getting to the end. Everyone, uh, someone just said beautiful. Like, they love the results. Thank you. Well, she's not quite finished. We're going to separate her curls and we're going to fluff it. Mm -hmm. It's going to be bomb. So, stay tuned for that, for sure. So yeah, thank you. You guys follow behind the chair and follow Oplex, follow me. And yeah, stay tuned for the next one. Happy holidays. <laughs>